All right, so we can see this left front door has quite a lot of damage to it. And I'm going to try to glue pull as much of this as possible. See, there's a nasty dent back in the back of the door. But I'm gonna get started and I'm just gonna be using Kiko tabs um, with a, just a regular style lifter. So we'll see how this goes. Thanks for watching guys. So, a little progress on the WRX. It's looking a lot better. Just figured I would get it outside and take a look. So, you can see the difference between the buff, the buff side and the not non-buff side. Oh, this side's all dirty, but it's super scratched up and faded. So we'll get started on the quarter and the left rear door. So right rear door, sorry. Okay, so we've got some pretty significant issues going on with the uh, right rear door. Somebody tried to do that once before, so that'll be fun. Um, yeah, the paint's pretty messed up, so we'll see what we can do with it. Uh, the quarter panel also has had some work done. Not body work, but it looks like it was a little paintless dent repair. And it just needs to be finished up, so. Weird spot there. And yeah. The rest of the quarter doesn't look too bad, so. Just that one little spot and the little spot in the front there. Up here by the gas door. I'll get started. All right, right quarter panels all done. Turned out perfect. Probably the easiest part of this whole job. 
So that's always nice. Makes you feel really good. <laughs> Time to move on to the door. get all these dents here that one that one that one with this rod here so that's the tip I'm gonna use nice soft plastic tip should push those dents out nice and easy So this one's all been picked out and now I got a, it's all wet sanded through 3000 and we're just gonna buff this sucker up. <laughs> that door has been in quite a while looks sweet all right guys so moving on to the last panel here and you can see we've got a real nasty spot there I worked on for quite a while it was somebody else's PDR and I'm trying to clean it up so the rest of the door is looking a lot better there's still a few little ripples um, on the top of the door, really hard to see though. Um, but I just need to work on this for quite a while here. Try to get this as 
good as possible because this is really the last bad spot on the car. The rest of the car is looking pretty good. So, anyways, I'm gonna get cranking on this. You can see here I've got some random stuff going on. Uh, I've just got a you know regular strap there going to the striker, and then this is just an old plastic tube, but it works. Door's not moving anywhere, so. And then we're just gonna go through the, the hole here. You can see I've got that wrapped up so that we don't uh, crack any paint there on the edge. Got this door all completely torn out. So I've got all this stuff, all the guts out of it for the most part. And you can see there's not really much access here. We got just a couple little holes on the top. Um, and then the bottom is, you know, this brace goes down about four, four and a half inches. So anything on the top there, you got to do with a wire tool or maybe you could fish a whale tail or something in there. I don't know. I'll have to get creative, but. guys so i worked really really hard on this top area but it's just not gonna be perfect you're gonna be able to see that but i knew you would my goal was basically to make this not catch your eyes bad but there's just a few uh areas there where it locked up really bad that first initial pull or push whoever pushed it pushed way too hard from the get-go right on the center of it and there's just a really nasty uh, spot that won't it won't lay down. So that's as good as that's gonna get. And then, yeah, you can see that the paint's pretty messed up there, but there's a dent there as well. So I'm gonna take care of that one and that'll pretty much wrap up this door. Everything else looks pretty good. I used a wire tool on the top of the door, just kind of cleaned that up. Uh, I went through these little holes here on the side. So here we go. We give it a buff and you know this is really the worst panel on the whole car but hopefully it won't look too bad once it's all back together and out in the sun so work on the lower dent Definitely turned out good. That spoiler looks awesome. You can tell the difference in the shade of the paint though. Quite a bit there. Pretty faded. I brought quite a lot of color back to it though. 
This thing has got a uh, really nice shine to it now.